This guy wants change. A change in the way the Philippines is perceived by the outside world and a change in the way it is run from the inside. So, he began writing. Ilustrado is Miguel Sehuko's debut novel. It hasn't been published yet, but has already won the 2008 Man Asian Literary Award and the Palanca Prize in the Philippines. Ahead of its highly anticipated release next year, two charities in London held an event in Marlebone on March 11 to introduce the 33-year-old to the British public. We have a mix of uh, literary events here where we invite authors uh, to come and speak about their work. And one of the things that um, we pride ourselves on is spotting the new literary stars. He hasn't been published yet. He's one of his manuscript, which is quite a precedent, um, which shows the quality of the work. And I think it will strike a chord with many Filipinos um, throughout the world. Alongside Asia House's Festival of Asian Literature director, Adrian Loftus Parkins, Sihuko explained his semi-autobiographical novel spans across 150 years of Philippine history and confronts issues like corruption among the rich and powerful. Senate and Congress have given these resolutions congratulating me. It's, it's, it's wonderful and it's, it's a great honor. Um, but I can't wait for them to read it. Um, <laughs> because we'll see if I, I get that again. I, I hope so. Sihuko was born in Manila but has spent much of his life outside the Philippines. That contributed to another central theme. A book about being a Filipino living abroad, um, as there so many of us are doing. Um, and I wanted to write about the Filipino ex that aspect of the Filipino experience. It's not all carabaos and, and planting rice and amorsola portraits. It's uh, living abroad, feeling guilt about being abroad, wondering what we can do to help our country. Suhuko hopes once Ilustrado is released, it will not only live up to the attention it's getting, but actually stimulate change. Ed Lau, London.